This lock is going to represent your life. And the inside of this glass is going to represent death. And the bottom will represent salvation. Now, death can have different meanings to one's life. It depends on what a person believes. And just as death can have different meanings, so can the life one is living and the key to their life. Now, for some, there is no life after death. It is all about the life that they are living. The key to their life is their status in life, which means they are holding the key to being successful. But God, God teaches through His Word why there is death. Romans 5, 12. Therefore, just as sin came into the world through one man and death through sin, and so death spread to all men because all sin. Hear me on this. If one doesn't know the law of God, which is directed against them, it is impossible for them to know their sin. It is impossible for them to know that they need a Savior. I mean, compared to others, they may believe that they are good. But the Bible teaches us in Ecclesiastes 7, Surely there is not a righteous man on earth who does good and ever sins. Romans 3, 23. For all sin and fall short of the glory of God. I mean, in God's word, we can also find what the key to escaping death is. Know that we cannot escape on our own. Righteousness comes from Jesus. Philippians 3, 9. Do we need to confess with our mouth that Jesus is Lord? Yes. Do we need to believe with our heart that God raised Him from the dead? Yes. But why was there death? Because of sin. What is sin? An action, a feeling, or a thought that goes against God's perfect standards. What are His standards? The Ten Commandments. Many times we can feel as though we have the key to our lives, that we are in control. And the truth is, we need Jesus. John 10, 9. I am the door. If anyone enters by me, he will be saved and will go in and out and find pastor. Jesus is the door to salvation. The law is the God-given key to unlock the door of salvation. Psalm 19, 7. The law of the Lord is perfect. Reviving the soul. Now the law doesn't justify us. It leaves us guilty, teaching us that we don't have the key on our own. Bringing us to Jesus Christ that we would be justified through faith in His blood to receive salvation. On our own, we cannot defeat death. We don't have the key to salvation. But the key that we do have is the decision between a life with no meaning, ending in death, or a life that glorifies God with eternal life and salvation. The choice is ours. As always, thank you for watching. And until next time, God bless.